to the second match. Quarterfinal eight. High Tide launching a barrage, followed by the Robo Warriors. It's 36 to 39, but High Tide comes in in the last second and scores more, but the Blue Alliance has the advantage. Red Alliance needs a win here. Flame of the West picking up some power cells from the Blue Alliance player speed station. They launch one, they miss fire, but there's two, three, oh, two out of four are hit. But here's Robo Warriors coming over to the Blue Red Alliance sector. Riviera Robotics make some of their own. It's 59 to 44, Blue Alliance still in the lead. 24-29, that's the La Pinata Engineering Club working furiously to deliver power cells to their alliance partners with those accurate turreted shooters. Robo Warriors with a turreted shooter of their own as well as High Tide, able to accurately place those power cells into the upper power port for the Red Alliance. It's 73 to 62. 70, under 75 seconds left in this match. Riviera Robotics working that flail of doom like crazy. 25-84, Flame of the West. Lines up, launches four, gets three in. Riviera Robotics coming in right behind them. They're gonna try and score for the, the Blue Alliance. It's now 83 to 82, Red Alliance working furiously. High Tide getting two into the upper goal. 87-83, Red Alliance takes the lead for the first time. And then Flame of the West gets four in, but High Tide answers quickly, 96 to 92. Three, two, one, go, go, go. It's time to climb. <laughs> We've got Riviera Robotics going after the Robo Warriors and then pulling off before 15 seconds left. Robo Warriors. They're hanging precariously. Eight seconds left, 96 to 92. Can Riviera Robotics get a last second shot off? They don't. Is High Tide touching the ground? But the blue is six. Let's give a shout out to High Tide 4114, the Robo Warriors 2659, and Panther Botics 3863.